Okay, let me tell you about the problem we are trying to solve. Uh, first, as you know, each day we are generating more and more data. We are collecting more and more data. We have developed algorithms that permits to analyze the data to get insights, actionable insights. One of the problems that we have with all this data, it's still federated. In many places, you are collecting all these petabytes and petabytes of this data and using it for one use case. Then, for another use case, you are collecting the same data. This makes the use of this data very expensive. Mm -hmm. If you could just collect this data once and have it for everybody, for all the analytics use cases available, in a format, in a dictionary that can be understandable by everybody, you can not just save a lot of money, but it will be a, also an enabler to innovation because now you could use this data for use cases that could not permit the huge amount of money that will cost collecting this data. This is the catalyst. The catalyst is about the analytic big data repository, creating one big data repository that can be used by many stakeholders, mm -hmm. either internal stakeholders, different products bought from different companies, and different analytics uses. This is the catalyst. And what progress have you made today in terms of findings? Or okay, so we are working on this catalyst already one year. Mm -hmm. First, we start by investigating, is this something doable? What is the concept? What is the right concept? Mm -hmm. Then, the second phase of the catalyst was to take this concept and to do a kind of proof of concept. Mm -hmm. So, in San Jose, we presented several applications using this same data, this same data repository. But it still wasn't formalized, so we still didn't have any data dictionary, any definition that can be spread and can be used by everybody. Only the catalyst players knew about it. Mm -hmm. So, that was yeah. great, but it was just a proof of concept. For NIS, as part of the catalyst, we are planning to create a data dictionary and to have it open for all the participants and not only the participants to create from it an industry standard. And this is the goal for NIS. And I think it has a lot of value because, you know, it will permit third parties, internal users, to start using the same data to know what they can expect to find in this data repository, to know how to access it and to build on top of it their use cases. And who do you think should be interested in this catalyst? So if people are coming to Nice, who should come and see you or talk to you? Well, practically everybody. Start from the people doing the architecture, mm -hmm. design how their big data repository will look internally in each operator, but also all the stakeholders, all the entities inside the uh, operators that want to use this data, mm -hmm. but also all the vendor companies, because now as a vendor company that you're selling a product that plans to use big data analytics, you need to learn, okay, what I will find in the operator. I will find this data repository, how it can connect on from it to it. What information can I find there? So really, it's concerned everybody. Okay, thanks very much. Thank you.